This is BBC World News. I'm Sally Bundock with the business headlines. Japan's lifted its state of health emergency in Tokyo and eight other districts one month before the Olympic Games are due to start. It means bars and restaurants will reopen but with strict rules in place. Customers can only visit in ones or twos for 19 minutes at a time and venues must close by 8 p.m. Sweden's Prime Minister Stefan Lauvien has spent the weekend trying to prevent a vote of no confidence in his government scheduled for Monday, but without success. Politicians in Stockholm are divided over the issue of controlling rents for newly built apartments, a rigid system the government wants to loosen. Well, you'll be seeing a lot more of these on the UK High Street. McDonald's is saying it wants to expand ahead of an expected pickup in the UK economy after lockdown. The fast food giant says it's looking to fill 20,000 rolls across the UK and Ireland this year as part of plans to open 50 new outlets. The prices of Bitcoin and Ethereum have continued to plummet as China stepped up its crackdown on cryptocurrency mining in various provinces. Concerns over how much energy the process uses had led the authorities to shut down some of the world's biggest mining operations. And those are the business headlines on BBC World News.